Katy Perry makeup look inspired by her new video last Friday night, TGIF. It's a very kind of fun 80s look. I'm going to start by using a domed brush. This is from my Blush Professional 18 piece brush set and I'm using this color here. This is a BH Cosmetics. 120 palette. It's the number one palette with kind of bright colors and at the end of the video you can win this entire palette. So do check out the link at the end of this video if you want to win one. I'm going to dot this pearly white iridescent color here in the inner corner of the eye and then I'm expanding that over the lid a bit. And now on the same brush I'm going to use this kind of goldy white and I'm going to pop that on the lid progressing from the white that we just placed. So we're going a little bit further along the lid, up to the crease of the eye. I'm going to use this turquoise iridescent pigment by Bourgeois. It's a Suivez mon regard in color number 24. It's called Regard Bleu Swimming Pool. And it comes with its own little brush. I'm going to be using that. Slightly tapering over the edge of our golden color. I'm going to use this shader brush from my Blush Professional set. And I'm going to choose this cobalt blue color here it's in the corner of the eye, coming in towards our sparkling turquoise. And then using the dome brush I used earlier, I'm going to just take some more of this slightly golden iridescent white and I'm going to taper over the edge of our turquoise color just to make that edge more subtle. And using another shader brush, I am going to choose this sky blue here. It's a matte sky blue. I'm going to place the sky blue above the crease. I'm using a Sigma E45 small tapered blending brush. I'm going to smooth out those edges. And I'm going to pick up some of this color here. It's kind of like a slightly purpley fuchsia. And I'm just going to start at the outer corner above the crease. And then work that color upwards. That has a bit of a kind of like a pink sunset over the sea kind of effect. I'm going to use this Blush Professional Buff Brush and I'm going to take this matte white color here and I'm going to use this to highlight the brow bone. I'm going to use this smudger brush and this bright purple right here and I'm going to start at the just under my lower lash line here coming upwards. And going about a third of the way along, and then you want to edge that color inwards. And on the same brush, I am going to grab a little bit of this cobalt blue we used earlier, and this I'm placing along the lower lash line around in the center. I'm grabbing some of this iridescent turquoise color and blending into the blue, and Going up to the corner of the eye. Next I'm going to use this eyeliner by Bourgeois. It's called Ife Smoky. It's number 78 New Wave Blue. It's a beautiful grey blue. And I'm going to line my lower waterline. And I'm going to use my Extra Volume Collagen Mascara by L'Oreal. We want long, wispy, but voluminous lashes. I'm going to give a good coat to my top lashes as well. Now you want to get your black liner. I'm using an Eye Sweet Precision Eye Definer by Mimi Me. And you want to create quite a skinny line. And I'm going to use these lashes I got at Blush Cosmetics. They're called Active Cosmetic Number no. 3 Lashes. And you want to paste your lash really close to your upper lash line. I'm going to use a Blush Professional Blush Brush and I'm choosing this kind of a soft pinky color and lightly dust that over the apples of your cheek. And now I'm going to take some of this purple that we used on the eye and use this for the contouring shade. This will be a nice subtle shadow underneath our pink. And on a Sigma F35 Tapered Highlighter Brush, I'm going to just dab some of this slightly pearly white color that we used earlier and I'm placing that here under the eye for a shimmering highlight. I line my lips in a lip liner by Rimmel. This is number 63 East End Snob. I'm going to go over with you.
I'm lining outside my natural lip line. And I've filled in the lips with this color by Sleek. It's called Fuchsia, and it's one of their sheen lipsticks. And it's a beautiful hot pink. And it really gives it that pop for an 80s look.